Oh, big yawn for the first start of the day. 2015. Lovely to see you. Hello, YouTubers. Paul here. Um, I've been asked to do a, a vlog on the examiners. <laughs> um, well, basically they were just asking, you know, what are they like? You know, is there a quota that they have to do? You know, pass and fail and all that sort of stuff. Um, well, <laughs> let me just tell you from the start, there is no quota. Don't forget that. There's no such there's no such thing as a quota on the test. You're either good enough to pass your test, um, or you're not good enough to pass your test. So if myself or Wayne um, takes you to the test centre itself, it's because we're expecting you to pass. Okay. If we thought um, you weren't good enough to pass, then we would withdraw you from the uh, training, give you extra training, and then take you to the test centre. Okay. Um, the examiners themselves, I won't name them because I think that's a bit unfair, uh, but we use the Herne Bay Test Centre. And the examiners that we use are, well, they're a couple of top bananas, to be honest with you. One's a lot older than the other. <laughs> I won't see which one that is. Um, but, um, yeah, they're, they're both good guys. And uh, to be honest with you, they're probably willing you to pass. They're bikers themselves, obviously. They've got years of experience. And there's nothing they don't really know about motorcycling. And if you pass um, uh, or fail, um, although it doesn't happen that much, to be honest with you, but if you was to fail, um, they'll still give you as much information to help you out, you know. They're not ogres. They don't have a swinging pendulum of lead for their hearts. They're just good guys and uh, they're there to do a job. Um, and to be honest with you, if you think about it, when it comes down to the test, they've got 35 to 40 minutes to decide if you're going to be okay at that moment for the rest of your life. It's not a um, responsibility that I would like to have. I mean, I get all week uh, plus to um, train you up and get you up, up to a high standard. And um, I don't know if you're good enough because it's what I do. And that's what Wayne does as well. So obviously we know if you're up there and you're ready for the test and you've got no worries. But on the day, it's down to you and your nerves. There's nothing we can do about your nerves. And obviously everyone being human nature gets a bit nervous. But there's no need to be worried about the examiners. And when you meet them, you know, most people will say, oh no, they're all right, aren't they? They're good guys. They're nice people. And that's what they are. All right, so just to, just to clarify then, there is no quota. And the people that are doing your tests, very professional, very nice people indeed. And uh, they're always there to, to give advice and help as well. You know, there's, um, like I said, they're bikers. Okay. So I hope that, uh, that clears up a few things. Um, if it doesn't, then ask again and a, a, a more sort of direct question of what it is you want to know and I'll try and answer it. Um, but remember, it's 2015 now. We're in January. So what are you doing? If you haven't booked your bike course, get it done. Man up and get a grip. Otherwise, you'll have to stay in them four-wheeled skips with steering wheels and crap like that. <laughs> so, yeah, what you're waiting for. And to be honest, if you're looking around now, it's not exactly that cold, is it? There's no snow. It's nice and warm, I think. Um, you know, so we're having a good year for this at the moment. So, um, why not give us a call? Hello, 1843 596960 and uh, book your motorcycle training course and let's get you out there riding okay well thanks very much i'm off to work and i'll um hopefully talk to you soon and see you soon okay youtubers bye bye